Now the other place we got souvenirs is when we went to the fish fry, they had off to the side, they had just had um, some tables with people selling stuff. Now not the best quality things, but um, I didn't know if I was going to be able to find other souvenirs. So I just bought a bunch of keychains. I bought this purple one. I bought this magnet. I bought this one in a magnet form and this keychain one. No, I didn't realize it's the same thing, but um, I'll probably give one to the kids. And yeah, those four magnets. And I think this is also from there. Yeah. So I got this magnet. Which is cool, it has a cruise ship, some birds, palm trees, and it's just a magnet. Got this one. It says Barbados. And then this dolphin one. This is Barbados there. And this um like beer bottle opener. Which looking at it now I don't like it that much. I was gonna give it to my brother, but Oh well, um, I don't like it that much. There were a lot of other ones that I've seen after this uh, that I like better, and they weren't. These things were not super cheap. Like they were like three or four dollars each, like plastic um, keychain that probably cost them a dollar. But yeah, that's gonna go in. I'm putting the stuff in like each of the bags. So um, yeah. This one is cute though. But. Yeah, I'm going to keep this magnet for myself. I'm just going to put this in there and throw this out. So then, let me see if I find other things. We went to the um, boat yard, which is just like a beach and i guess it's you can't really charge for a public beach for people to go to but what they do is they have chairs and stuff and umbrellas that you can sit on and they have different activities like they had a trampoline in the middle of the water they had an iceberg which was like a rock climb iceberg but it wasn't an iceberg it was just like this plastic thing that you had to um climb on then they had a rope swing that was on the bridge so they, you go in and you get a wristband and it was $100 for Barbados for the both of us. So it was like $50, which is like 25 a person, but they also give you this card. Um, so it's basically out of the $25, I think it was um, $5 US to enter and then the rest you get back. Um, as a voucher on that card so you could use it on drinks and food at the bar so um, It was a good deal, but they get you in the end anyways because they force you to eat there um, Even if you don't want to now the food was all right, but it was Not what I have like hoped for but yeah, they give you this wristband. This one's mine just as a boat yard and this is Okay, where do I start? There's so much stuff. Okay, so I bought this cap. This I bought at Woolworths, and it was $18.95, but half of it was like $9. And yeah, I bought this one after I got the orange one because I didn't really like that one that much because it didn't say West Indies, and I wanted one that said West Indies, so I found this one. And so I got some postcards, which I'll show you right now. And I got some magnets too. So I got this keychain that just says Barbados and it's like the rubber one that is pretty generic and you see um, everywhere, like the different places you go to. And then I bought this magnet, which I thought was cute. It's a rubber magnet and they were each um, seven, what does it say, $7.95 and half of that is like $4. So as I said, magnets and keychains are not that cheap there. Uh, so I didn't get that many, but I also got this one, which I thought was really cute. I have one similar to this, I think, from Aruba, 
but this is Barbados in purple and blue because purple is my favorite color and there's two little fish and this was four dollars as well and it just has like this little glass thing full of sand at the bottom and then I bought 10 postcards my boyfriend helped me pick them out at Woolworths they were a dollar each so they were 50 cents um, but I bought five little ones and five big ones so I bought this one and this one and this one this one and then this one because it showed the beach and the monkeys and flowers and the turtles so these are the big ones that I bought this is Oyston Oyston's fish fry which we went to and I have a picture there and that's where they cook your fish and like these little bars and those are little shops that I was telling you about that I bought some souvenirs got this big one this one this one of the clear blue water and this one so about 10 postcards so these are five dollars okay so I'm going to continue with my souvenirs now um, it's now later in the day so it's kind of darker okay never mind I just turned on the other light and it seems to be the same but yeah this is the beach blanket that I brought it's from pink Victoria's Secret and I've brought this to California too it has like the pink logo and yeah I kind of use it on the plane going because it's clean um and then on the way back i just put it in my luggage because it's dirty so now it's kind of dark again but anyways in here i have some souvenirs there and then i put the heavy stuff in here because my suitcase left with 35 and a half pounds and came back 51.8 which is supposed to be 50 pounds for your um like um check-in bag but they let me pass with the 51.8 and i had to pay 20 i think it was like 29 dollars it's 25 plus taxes or something but yeah i brought some movies with me um i didn't watch all of them they were just mainly for the plane ride and if i was bored at the hotel but um i didn't really get bored at the hotel because uh we just like went back to the room and kind of just fell asleep but I brought music and lyrics and I brought some more too but they're in my backpack um I'll show you I brought dance moms hi Roxy and you didn't have dog stuff there I'm sorry Roxy's right here I brought season one which I watched can you stop kissing me season one which I watched going to Miami um and I brought season three volume one and in here, what I'm here, oh, they're just my shoes. I only brought um, one pair of Michael Kors sandals and then my Trump sandals, but I ended up not wearing them, but they're so pretty. And these are like the most comfortable shoes I have. They were the, like one of the most expensive, but yeah. And then I brought another dress that I never wore, another dress that I never wore. Mm my straightening iron that i didn't use because i don't need it um and i bought a mug it came in this cute um box that reminded me of these starbucks ones and it was ten dollars which was a pretty good deal uh, because of the duty free thing i was talking about before i'll show you the mug right now they put tape on it which is annoying Okay, so luckily the tape didn't rip the sides of the box. Well, Black Bear, I didn't bring you anything. I'm sorry. They didn't have a dog store there. They didn't have Petco. I'm sorry. So, this is the box. Oops. Okay. Now, this is the mug that I picked out. They had a ton of different mugs. But this one just says Barbados. And, yeah, it just has turtles on it. And 
Oh, this is eleven dollars. I don't know why it's in here. Oh, um. But yeah, then I got some. Okay, I got some beach towels for the kids. Um, this one just says Barbados, and it has a palm tree, and it's red and yellow, which is really bright, but it has dolphins, and it's really cute. So it's that one, and it's just like that. And then I got this one. That is black outlined and has really cute birds and parrots that we did not see. We didn't see dolphins either, but that's okay. And it says Barbados at the bottom. So, yeah, it doesn't have a tag, so I don't know where it's made from, but hopefully there. And then I got one more. Okay, so then I got this towel for myself. It is blue and it says Barbados at the bottom and it has a turtle and another turtle and some fish and something goes to the top so I thought this one was really cute and that's it in this bag and I brought candy I know it ate so yeah, this was at the fish fry um, marketplace. They had tables, as I said. So I bought two towels for the kids at one vendor, or like one person selling it. And then this one was somewhere else. Um, and then, what's in here? Oops. I guess I'll show you the two t-shirts that I bought at the... Cave Shepherd Place. So we went on. Do you see the date? No, it doesn't say the date. No, that was on May 10th. We didn't go on May 10th. Oh, here, May 23rd at 5 25. And one shirt was, well, they both came out to eighty-one eighteen, which I gave a hundred Barbados, which is fifty dollars, and they gave me that much back, so it's like forty, like forty-one dollars. But this is the shirt that I got. I got this pink shirt that says Barbados West Indies. And this is by the brand Gansey, the Island Shop. And this one in American dollars was 22. And it just says um, medium. And then this one, this was the smaller size that they had. But I really, really like the shirt. It says Barbados and like cursive. And this palm tree. And this is white and blue. And it's by the same brand. And Tex! Hi, Tex! This one was a bit cheaper. Jinxie! This one was $19. And this one was a large. But it's by the brand Gildan, so it's really soft. And yeah. Tex, come here! Okay, so that's it for this bag. I think I'm gonna empty it out and put all my souvenirs in one place.